Hello everyone, in this video, I will show you how to configure proxy jets in Nginx. But please note, this work only if you use proxy configuration. First, create proxy jets path configuration. First parameter is path where jets will be saved. Second is subfolder level. Third is jets K which we will use inside location configuration later. And after colon or 1M is total K data to store. It's about 8000 K. Fourth is total space maximum size all jets in your disk. In this example, is 10 gig. Fifth parameter is how long jets will remain without being accessed. Sixth parameter is to tell Engine X not use temporary pad to generate jets, or to tell Engine X directly create jets inside pad on first parameter. After that, create folder you specify on parameter 1, where jet will be saved. Next, go to Nginx config again, and add location config to test jets. Please note, config proxy underscore jets and proxy underscore jets underscore valid is must. If you omit this config, in my case, Jet will not generate. Other proxy jet config is optional as far as I know, but I suggest you to add this config. And don't forget to put proxy underscore pass config. Next, start your backend server that specify in your upstream configuration. In this example, I use GUnicorn using Sequin as backend server. After that, open command line, point it to engine X folder, and open again command line, point it to engine X folder for later use to restart or stop engine X and start engine X server. Next, after engine X server start, open your browser and type localhost slash test underscore chats underscore proxy and you will see message hello G unicorn from backend server. Next, I will show you that you cannot use push URL or push method because it only exists in Engine X commercial.
Okay, I hope this video can help you to configure chats in Nginx and understand the basic concept. If you have question, suggestion, or request, please leave it in comment below. Please like this video if useful. Please subscribe for more tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.